What is going on guys? This video today is going to be a Funko Pop unboxing haul and a haul of another thing I collect that um, I kind of posted on Instagram last night. If you follow me on Instagram, you already know about it. I'm sitting in my new gaming chair as well, which if you follow me on Instagram and Twitter, you would also know about it. If you don't follow me on any of these things, description box for all that. But anyway, like I said, we have an unboxing. Um, this is from Amazon, um, but I think I'm going to save this for last because I got five pops four other things to show you so this is i guess the main event we'll just say and we'll put that off to the side it's a lot of wwe today i'll be honest um obviously you guys know and you can just see by looking behind me uh, when it comes to pops i collect star wars basketball um crash bandicoot anything else anything i'm into i i, I pretty much get but um it's mostly wrestling and star wars but i mean um but that's usually what these uh pop hauls are but it's mostly wrestling today i have two non-wrestling items and the rest of it's all wwe items. but i do collect wwe uh elite figures as well not all of them there is a lot coming out because they have gotten like i don't say better they've always been pretty good but they've uh really stepped up their game with how good the elites have been probably the past like year and a half um so there's been a lot of them coming out just recently that i've wanted to get my hands on and i'm still waiting not my stores around me aren't the best with getting stuff in my walmart um just got in this one series last week and they only had so many of them luckily i was able to get three um of one specific series but i see people's um you know online and their walmarts are getting in the elite series with like ricochet and ali and my stuff my walmart hasn't gotten any of that but we do have these couple things so three of them i did get at walmart one of them i got at luke and kate's collectible store which i've talked about plenty of times in pop videos so we'll just get into uh the elite figures over here so first things first it is all from these first three are from the SummerSlam series spoiler alert uh series 68 we got the big dog roman reigns this is a really cool just spot on action figure man just look how good he looks i love that they're coming with uh interchangeable hands now like he's already got the like the you know samoan uh hands in if you want to say but this is just a really cool one sorry about the reflection from my phone it's come with comes with the universal title this is obviously based off last year's SummerSlam. Um, but this is uh, a really cool figure. It's my first Roman Reigns Elite, I believe. Yeah, this is my first Reigns Elite, so it's a really cool one. So definitely glad to pick that one up. Next up from that series, we have the Daniel Bryan, which is also based off last year's gear with the Seattle Seahawks uh, colors gear, which I love. He's got the yes fingers in there, which you can see. A great head scan. The head scans um, are one of the things that have you know really gotten even better on these elites. And you got the uh, yes, uh, fight for your dreams uh, t-shirt that uh, came out last year that he was rocking. So we got the Daniel Bryan one right there. Um, absolutely love this figure as well. Now, the last one I picked up um, from that series uh, was this one, which is the American Badass Undertaker from 2000. This is a really cool taker as well. Um, the Braun Strowman uh, is a cool figure, but I wasn't really interested in it. The King Mabel is a great figure, but not really interested, and I had no interest in picking up the uh, Brie Bella one from this series. So I got the three that I wanted. This Undertaker, like I said, is just an awesome figure. Love that it comes with the uh, the Kane mask. This is based off the uh, 2000 SummerSlam um, Undertaker. So awesome, awesome figure. Really glad to pick this one up. American Badass Taker is uh, probably my favorite Taker. So we got Undertaker, Roman Reigns, and uh, Daniel Bryan from the SummerSlam series. And then this one I picked up, like I said, at um, Luke and Kate's collectible store. They posted probably, let's just say, I want to say it's like two Tuesdays ago, um, that they got this whole series in, but I wasn't able to get uh, up to the store, which is probably like a half hour away for like a week. So the time I got there, they only had this one and uh, another one in the series, which I'll tell you in a second. But this one that I did pick up, which I'm really at least glad they had this one, and I was very happy to pick up, is the... Rey Mysterio from uh, Series 69. So, yeah, they had this whole series at one point. Ricochet, Ali, Champa, Lashley, uh, Miz is the only one that I didn't want um, besides, you know, uh, the rest of them. Um, yeah, but, you know, they of course, they were sold out of uh, all of them. They had, like, two Rays and one Miz or something like that. Um, but I didn't want the Miz. I want to pick up the rest of them. But at least I got this one, um, which is obviously the one I want the most because Rey Mysterio is my guy. He's got the T-shirt that came uh, that he came back with last year at the 1000th episode of SmackDown. Um, and he's got just an awesome, like, tealish green uh, gear on, which from the back says it's based off of when he faced Andrade in a 2 out of 3 falls on SmackDown earlier in January of this year. Um, I vaguely remember. But it's an awesome figure. I love Rey Mysterio. And I actually did pick up. Um, I never showed this. I'm about to just grab it real quick. I did pick up this figure as well, um, literally back in June and never showed it because I wasn't making videos at the time, but it's the Series 67 uh, Rey Mysterio Halloween Havoc one. So I'm glad to pick up this and now have uh, this one to go with it. Obviously, I'm picking up all the Rays. I'm still waiting to find that um, basic series that came out with uh, him in like an orange WCW gear. I don't know if that's out in stores. I don't know because my stores never get anything, but... 
Besides that, those are the Elite figures, so we'll get into the Funko Pops now. We have five to show, plus the unboxing. We have two uh, non-WWE ones, so we'll get into those first. First things first, I got this probably two weeks ago at GameStop, and it is the Pokemon Squirtle. Um, so now I pretty much have, or I do have, every single uh, Pokemon one. We got uh, Pikachu, whether you can't see them, they're out of picture, but uh, Pikachu, Bulbasaur, Charmander, and now uh, Squirtle. So glad to add that to the collection. It's a really cool one. Next up, I got this at a uh, Hot Topic last Monday, and it is the Garfield Pop. Garfield's one of those old school comic uh cartoons you know the, i mean there was a cartoon as in the newspapers you know it's a comic man it's a it's an old school thing um but i some somehow uh still was a part of my childhood even though it's kind of before my time um but it was it's really cool and i did see the od as well that is in this series um but i didn't pick it up i do want to pick it up honestly eventually but i just wanted to get the garfield for now um so it's a really cool one i do want to try to hunt down that uh funko shop exclusive uh garfield that uh, it's got the mug that says like i hate mondays or some shit like that i forget um but yeah really cool pop right there so this is tracing back probably two weekends ago something like that maybe three um since um i you know started getting this uh this haul for this video so first things first they're all coming from the uh newest WWE series so we have the undertaker found this at a GameStop in a mall um very hefty pop i haven't taken it out of the box but uh definitely a cool one I wasn't really, you know, too excited for another Undertaker pop since we have gotten ones before. Um, but it still is a cool one. You know, I, I preferably want to see WWE or see Funko make, you know, new WWE ones like, you know, Elias and Becky Lynch and Trish like they did in this series. People who haven't had pops before, but this is still a cool pop. And I had to pick it up for the collection anyway, so there's a cool one there. Next up, I found this at another collectible store, which I'll be honest, I don't even know what the name of it is. It's just a toy store. Um... I don't, I couldn't tell you the name, so I can't shout them out. It's obviously a local thing, but it is the Brett the Hitman Hart from this series. Another one, which uh, Brett already has an older pop. And this is still a cool one, but like I said, I would prefer uh, new people who haven't had pops. Um, but this is still a really cool one. This is obviously, uh, I, well, I, I don't know. I don't have the original one, and I forget what it looks like, so I'm not going to compare the two. But this is still really cool. Um, the colors on it obviously make Brett in this, uh, this pop. And, you know, like I said, just like The Undertaker, it's part of the collection, so... I gotta have it. And then uh, next up, you can probably guess what this one is. It is Elias. Obviously, we already got Becky and Trish up there. Got Taker and uh, Bret Hart right there. And now you got Elias. So pretty much completing the set. I was really wanting an Elias for a while. Um, so when this got revealed months ago that it was going to be coming out, I was very excited. But it just looks so cool. He's got the guitar in there and whatnot. And uh, just very glad to pick this one up for my collection. Um, and like I said, it's a new character, a new character, a new superstar, a new pop that has not gotten a pop before. So I was very happy for it. And it's one that I won for a while. Um, and I would have loved if they made like a chase version of him sitting down playing the guitar. I think that would have been great. Um, so yeah, we got that. And then last but not least, the main part of this video, the last part, I should say, the unboxing. So this is coming from Amazon and you can probably guess what it is. Let's be honest here, but you know, we'll, we'll act, we'll act surprised if I can get in here here we go honestly i didn't i forgot to mention this but uh it doesn't sound like there's a lot of uh it's, it's really packed in here kind of sounds like it was moving around when i you know picked it up and stuff and even moved the box a little bit so hopefully what's in here isn't damaged um or at least came in like a oh god what is this Okay, well, uh, we have the Amazon exclusive Becky Lynch, and as you can see, this thing been, has been through the ringer a little bit. Just thrown in a box, no, no, no bubble wrap, no, uh, you know, other, another cardboard box around this to keep it safe, and, uh, now we have a giant dent in the back, and it looks like it got chewed by a beaver. Uh, Amazon, you know, I've never had bad luck with, uh, ordering stuff online. So this is the first time. Um, and now that I ordered this from Amazon and I should have just did what I did last time and ordered it on WWE shop since they eventually go on there anyway. Uh, can you guys, look at, can you guys see the dent? I mean, come on, like it's hard to, it's hard to tell like that, but like this is just, come on, man. Look at the bottom. This thing got... This thing got chewed. Why would you not put anything else in the box? Like, hopefully, maybe, hold on, let me see if I can, 
it obviously goes back in but that's annoying i mean i'll put i'm still gonna put a prop protector on it just to keep the rest of it nice so you really won't be able to see that but that's still annoying it's not the biggest deal in the world the pop's fine the face of the pop box is fine it's just the bottom part in the back so it's not the biggest deal in the world but still annoying uh, whatever but anyway you know you guys already see what it is i don't need to say it but it's the becky lynch the man amazon exclusive pop i pre-ordered this back in like march or whenever it was that it went up and uh obviously it finally shipped and uh obviously amazon did not ship it too greatly but at the end of the day what are you gonna do as you can see the box is f -f -f fucked back there but uh hopefully once i put in a pop protector and just set it on the wall um or set it on the shelf it, I'll, I'll forget about it eventually and you won't even be able to see it but yeah i do like the amazon exclusive sticker though i don't have anything that's got that on there so that's cool but anyway um not to kill the vibes thanks a lot amazon you really killed the vibes of this video video but you got the becky lynch exclusive amazon uh funko pop you got the undertaker you have brett the hitman heart you have elias pokemon squirtle you got Garfield as well, Rey Mysterio, Undertaker, Daniel Bryan, and Roman Reigns. Anyway, so that's all they, they uh, Amazon really killed my vibes and is throwing me off here. But that's all for this video. Um, six pops, four figures, pretty sweet haul today. And a gaming chair that has nothing to do with this video, but it's comfortable as hell. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. If you're not subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe. And that'll do it. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.